In this video, you will get to know, in detail about, perpetual or non-perpetual inventory, in SAP Business One. When you set up SAP Business One, you need to define, how to control the inventory valuation, according to business needs, and local legal settings. You have two choices, for defining inventory valuation. A perpetual inventory system, or a non-perpetual inventory system. A perpetual inventory system, reflects the value of inventory postings, in terms of monetary transactions, in the accounting system. These monetary transactions, are carried out, when items, defined as inventory items, are received, or released from stock. In a perpetual inventory system, inventory transactions, affect both stock levels, and stock value. Automatic journal entries, for the change in stock value, are created in the general ledger. In our course's business example, we work, with a perpetual inventory system, so this is what you see, in the demonstrations and practice sessions. The other choice is to use, a non-perpetual inventory system, in which sales, purchasing, inventory, and production transactions, automatically create inventory transactions, which affect only the inventory levels, and have, no effect on the stock value. Transactions in a non-perpetual inventory system, do not generate, automatic inventory related monetary entries, directly into the general ledger. However, it is possible, to get an estimate of inventory value, using different inventory reports. Thanks for watching this video, do write us for any queries.